about when defenses face a rookie quarterback and how they try to make it difficult for him. So what do you tell Baker to expect and how do you try to prepare him for maybe things that he hasn't seen before? I think that, you know, we're doing that every week with all the players, but especially at the quarterback position and a young guy, you know, you're, you're, you're doing your best to get him to just lean on his rules, um, you know, that he's uh, supposed to try to stay closely following, you know, and, uh, and everything we have, we have rules, whether it's guys up front line, you know, you're, you gotta always be expecting the unexpected and you gotta have a plan for how to handle those situations. And it's no different at quarterback. So that's one reason you're confident and the team is confident with Mayfield start. Well, I think, um, anytime you come in a game as a young player and do what he did last week, it builds confidence. You know, I think there's a confidence from his teammates uh, to him. You know, when you go in and, and hadn't had a lot of reps and you can go in and command the offense the way he did and help lead the team to victory, I think uh, that says that, hey, you know, this guy can help. How different is the Baker that you perceived before he got here from the one that is here? Um, I didn't know what, I mean, I know he won the Heisman, but I didn't have any, like, predetermined things. You know, you hear people say, oh, he's Johnny or he's this or he's that, but... Since I've known him, he's been a great guy. He's worked hard. He's been in the building. Um, everything you want in a quarterback, and uh, that's all you want. He's a confident guy, so I think people see that as a little bit of cockiness, but he's just confident in what he does, and he, he understands he put in the work, and he's ready to compete, and he's ready to play, and that's all you want in a quarterback. How much do you think of Mayfield, though, to have you know, the week with the starters before he uh, I mean, a, a lot, you know, um, obviously, you know, getting an opportunity, you know, for all of us to be in there, um, um, catching balls from him and, um, you know, just hearing him in a huddle, hearing his voice, you know, obviously on the road, it's going to be loud. So, you know, that's going to be a big thing, communication for us. So um, it's good um, for him, especially getting the whole week. Jefferson, any rookie quarterback is ever really ready, but when did you know six um, I mean, since since the day they drafted him, you know, um, obviously understanding the potential um, and, and the things that he can do um, and, and what makes him special and having the guys around him, you know, with, with the trust level um, at a premium, you know, to make the plays as well. The Raiders obviously are going to have a chance to now game plan for you. Um, you know, as the Jets, obviously, we're looking at Tyrod first and foremost, but you said earlier, like, you know, you have very high expectations because you hadn't been with the ones. Do you think that, you know, just being able to be with that first unit can kind of outweigh a team having a chance to really look at you ahead of time? They can game plan for me, but we got other skilled guys. Uh, we got guys that are doing their job very well right now. And like I said, my job is to get the ball in their hands. So. I'm not going to be the one to run around and create all the plays. I'm just going to do my job and let them do it.